Hello. <laughs> it's um, Saturday, April the 1st. April Fool's Day. <laughs> Plenty of fools around here. <laughs> Not saying a thing. Um, we're in Newark. Newark on Trent. Mm -hmm. um, we are at the Brown Hills. What's it called? Strictly Motorhome. Yeah. Strictly Motorhome this come dancing. This one that we mentioned earlier on in the year where yeah. the motorhomes do a, I don't do, know, do a dance. Um, yeah, we're. Play or something. <laughs> yeah, we're. Um, we arrived last night, um, and they had a band on last night in the, um, you know, in the showroom. Yeah. The buddies. Yeah, they were good. Yeah, they were. Um, All rock and roll. I'll try and put a bit of. Roll. <laughs> it's the first time she's been out. In case, in case you didn't realise, I think I said on one of the earlier videos, she's hurt her knee, so um, been struggling to walk. This is the first time we've been out since she's hurt herself. It's like letting a caged tiger out. Honestly, <laughs> um, I had, to, had to do chair dancing last night. Though. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure uh, Rick will put a bit of footage in. <laughs> yeah, Brownells lay on a free bus into Newark from the showroom. So we've caught the bus into Newark. So I don't know what we'll do this afternoon. We'll have a bit of a wander around the town as much as Heather can handle it. And then um, I think actually seriously in the showroom tonight, they've got some sort of stars from Strictly Come Dancing. We do don't know who they are. Yeah, we don't watch that. Dancing on ice for the win. <laughs> Records were like two ninety nine, <laughs> madness. One step beyond. Quite appropriate after that band last night played it, but twenty seven quid. What's going on? What are they made of? <laughs> Vinyl. <laughs> you can still buy them. Have well, these yeah. people not heard of eBay? I'm going to refrain from saying they don't like it up them. <laughs> I'm not surprised, really. Okay, so the reason for the man walking round with the big stick earlier <laughs> has become evident. It's a medieval fun day, apparently. So, let's have some medieval fun. I thought it was going to be the Ace of Spades for a minute. <laughs> Fooled me. Seems a good idea, what do you say, Pa? Dog friendly, and they sell beer. So we've just been in the Ram, which was lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Rick had a, what did you have? Uh, Citra, Session Pale or something. Oh yes, and I had ass balls, just like that. Um, and we were sat there and we was looking at the menu, and I did remind him that extreme close up. Wah! 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 Okay, all right. Okay. Excellent. The last time we came into Newark was when he was delicate. If you, if everybody remembers that. Oh, sorry, I'm a bit close. I was coming close because it was getting a bit windy. <laughs> not not because of the. You're supposed to look at the camera. Not because of the. <laughs> um, She's had one she pint. I've got some mushy peas from last night. Um, yes. So I reminded him that there was a, a place on the river called the Barge, Castle Barge Bar. So we're going to go and see 
what that's like because he couldn't go like well he so didn't, basically he didn't, we're going to another pub yeah, that's he, all didn't, he didn't want to go there last time because he was a bit delicate so yeah. Flick stuff. Well done. <laughs> okay, the professionals got the camera back now. Don't, don't, don't. You told me to, you gave it me. <laughs> you gave it me. You there we go. Three pound a pint Monday to Friday, but not on a Saturday. Dogs welcome. That's it then. So, the Castle Barge. Real ales. Let's have a go on here. Castle Barge friendly. Canines welcome. Even better. See if we can get some dinner in here. The Rilt Elise used to be a grain um, transporter. 200 tonnes of grain it used to hold. Was bought in 1979 for scrap value of 2,500 quid and converted into a bar in 1980, December 1980. It's been here since then. Um, so that's what, 43 years? 43 years this year. Uh, yeah, nice bit of basic food. Yeah. Really nice and nice, cheap and easy. And uh, another swift one. It would have been nice to go downstairs. But Somebody with a bad down. knee a didn't want to go downstairs, really. Um, so now we're going to catch the bus. I assume that the dog couldn't go down there, but she might yeah. have been able to. So now we're going to catch the bus back to Brown Hills and have a lazy afternoon. Righto, so we've just caught the bus back from Newark. Um, Heather's in there having a drink and a sit down. I'll just have a quick wander around. There are a couple of new vans here, a couple of auto trails. Um, I think that's an Expedition 67, and then that's a V Line 636. Lovely in black. strikes me as um, a bit strange that um, when we checked on the Fiat website picking the new van we'd only got three colour options and that was it you got the Expedition Grey which we've choosed, choosed, chosen um, the Lanzarote Grey or white you hadn't got black as an option so I don't quite know how they're getting hold of these uh, yeah this one's locked he says yeah it's a shame, but we've seen this one before anyway. It's it's the dinette with the small U-shaped lounge at the back. Um, as I say, we've gone for that colour in the new van. Quite looking forward to that. With the colour-coded bumper as well. Although that one is 52206. That's a six-metre van. Um, very much in the style of a... Eldest CV40 that one. Still a great deal of um, motorhomes. You can see loads of auto trails. Um, we see you've got that Sun Living one which I've had a look at before. There is absolutely nothing else knocking around other than uh, A classes. Very very light on vans still. Exciting times ahead. Guess the celebrities. We're in for a gripping night, folks. Look at the excitement on her face. <laughs> they have a funny accent. And every question you have, please direct it to Jeanette, okay? <laughs> she's American and she's much easier to understand. But I right? definitely don't sound super American. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen, if your wife you likes to speak a lot, yes, she needs to be a TV presenter. Because you know why? Then she gets paid for it. It's absolutely brilliant! And then she gets... Thank you. Thank you. That was a good one. <laughs> so, we're gonna do four of them, alright? We're gonna do four basics and four New Yorkers. Let's try it nice and slow. And uh, one, two, three. Cha-cha-cha. Back, three. Cha-cha-cha. Forward, three. Cha-cha-cha. Back, we go New Yorker. Cha-cha-cha. Two, three. Don't forget the arm. Two. Yes, yes. Cha, cha, cha. Up. Three. Cha, cha, cha. Up. Three. That's it. Nice. Beautiful. Should we try it? Music. Musica. Musica, please. Musica. A five. A six. A five, six, seven, and a four. Two, three. Cha, cha, cha. Back. And. Cha, cha, cha. Forward. And. Cha, cha, cha. Back.
<laughs> right, we're just leaving Brown Hills um, after the Strictly weekend. It was actually, we're not fans of Strictly, but it was quite good, really, weren't it? Yeah, it was okay. Uh, I did do a bit of video in. I thought you were going to say you did a bit of dancing then. <laughs> no, I didn't do a bit of dancing, did a bit of drinking. Um, yeah, we're just going to pop to SMC while we're in the area. So we're at SMC for a nosy round. Uh, they have got a few more panel vans here. Warwick XL there, old favourite. We've just been in and had a look at a brand new one. Still love them, but uh, the choice has been made now. Yeah, so they've got a fair few panel vans. There's a Warwick Duo there, 70. A few older ones down this end. Globe car. It's a wild axe here. Constellation class. Like the Enterprise, maybe. What's it like? Front bed jobs. It's only, yeah, I know that's the only that's the only downside. But six meter. Um, is that what it is, this one? Yeah, six meter. Yeah. Yeah. So it's an end kitchen and an end little washroom. I mean, the good thing about these type of vans is it gives you an enormous amount of space at the front. Really opens it up when you don't have something blocking the door like that. It's on a Citroen, this one. <laughs> right then, we are just about to leave SMC. Just had a quick nosy, really. Um, there's a few more panel vans here than Brownells, I think. You know, they've, as, they've got a lot of Continental vans, though, here. You can see straight in front, there's a Camp Scout one. Their Globe Car and Globe Car one, an yeah. Auto Sleeper stock is here. Yeah, they are, yeah. But nice to see a few vans. Um, mm -hmm. Anyway... Good weekend at Brown Hills. Uh, dancing was okay. Yeah, you did well. <laughs> yeah. Uh, um, he's, he's, learned, the, he's learned how to do the cha-cha slide and the, yeah. and the Gangnam style. <laughs> no. But yeah, considering we don't watch, well, it's, what's it called, Strictly Come Dancing, it was all right, really. Um, so anyway, we're going to go. Catch you on the next one. Don't forget, Facebook group. Uh, if you want more up-to-date stuff, this will probably be released near enough the end of April and we're... We're at the beginning of April now, whereas the Facebook people knew every day what we were doing this week, didn't they, really? So, yeah. if you're interested, you know, if you're not, who can blame you? If you want to see us singing. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Dancing in our chairs. <laughs> anyway, hold the dog. Come here, you. We're away. Sit down. Um, yeah, rock and roll now. Going shopping before we go home. Rock and roll. See you later, peoples. You want to say to Rob? Bye-bye, everybody. Poppy's saying bye-bye. <laughs> Which way are we going out of here? Right. Just check in. <laughs> yes, Poppy. I don't like a bloody pigeon. <laughs> AV, common as shit. Right. That's still running, I think. Mm -hmm. Cheers. I'll turn it off then. <laughs> <laughs>